So I thought I'd start out with probably the most requested film from you guys, which was The Virgin Suicides. Now this movie has a very dreamy, ethereal vibe to it, with the main characters being the Lisbon sisters. When I was trying to think of what look would be best to recreate for this video, I could not go past the iconic homecoming outfits. Of course, their super strict mum dressed them all in practically the same super modest ensemble, so to achieve the look all you need is a white maxi dress with a dainty floral print and then team it up with some cute little bobby socks and matching block heels and honestly I think I've nailed this look all that's missing is the signature blonde hair time to take a turn down a much darker path but still a 90s classic with the craft so these four witches obviously have more of a gothic feel to them but it's not too intense, which means it's still really easy to recreate. I'm going for Rochelle's look, and I had all of these items in my wardrobe already, so it would be great for a last minute costume idea, especially if you went with three of your friends and did like a girl squad sort of thing. Obviously, the key to all four girls' looks is a lot of black clothing and a little bit of white as well. If you're specifically going for Rochelle like I am here, then you cannot forget about your black suspenders, layered necklaces and chunky boots. And of course to set it all off, a little bit of black lipstick won't hurt. Another one that was highly requested by you guys was the American French film Lolita. I'm basing my look off the 1997 controversial remake. Keep in mind that Lolita is only supposed to be 14 years old in the film, so it's really important to keep her whole look very fun, youthful, and a touch of innocence. I think that really comes across with the blue polka dot shorts with that ruffle trim, and even in the smaller details like the hair style. She wears a lot of milkmaid braids or just plaits like I have here. One of the most memorable elements are her red love heart shades and matching lipstick which she doesn't actually feature in the film but they are all over the promotional posters and if you guys are Lana Del Rey fans I'm sure you know what I mean. Last but not least we have one of my favorite movie characters of all time Penny Lane from Almost Famous. So this movie was released in the year 2000, but of course it does have more of a 1970s theme to it, which again made it super easy for me to pull items out of my own wardrobe considering how big of a trend the 70s are at the moment. For Penny Lane's look specifically, I think all you really need is the coat that is the most iconic part of her ensemble, but to add to it, I think that you cannot go wrong with a pair of flares, any sort of crochet detailing on the top, a good pair of wedges, and top it off with some cute little shades. So that wraps up this video. I had so much fun on this one. I'm keen to do a part two. So let me know in the comments your favorite films or TV shows that I might be able to include in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah!